Boys and girls, oh, I miss Mud Pie Manners again. I didn't hear you come in. You must have snuck in quietly again, like you did last week. Well, today we're going to be doing some fun things. We are going to be making rainbow cookies. Remember last week we made rainbow placemats. Well, today I'm in my kitchen and we are going to be making rainbow cookies. But you know, the first thing we need to do is say hello to Miss Eddie. Miss Eddie, oh, remember she's shy. <gasps> Miss Eddie, can you come out and say hi? <gasps> oh, Miss Eddie, I'm so happy to see you today. And I love the flower in your hair, just like you had last week. Yes, do you know we're gonna be making rainbow cookies today? Can you say hi to the boys and girls? Yes, all right. Well, Miss Eddie, I'm gonna put you down because we need to wash our hands because we're gonna be cooking. And I'm in my kitchen, so I'm gonna wash my hands and dry them. And then I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna get my ingredients out. Now, the first thing I'm going to do is I took some plastic bags and I put in some flour. So I want you to put in a little bit of flour in your plastic bag, not too much, just a little bit, and squish it around like this. Yes, just sort of shake it around and then lay it aside and do the same thing for the next one. So I have this here and we're gonna shake it around and we're gonna lay it aside and do the next one. Shake it around, right? And then do the next one. Shake it around, shake, 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 yes. And the next one, we're gonna shake it around. And we should have about six paper bags. Now, the next thing we're gonna need is food coloring. And we're gonna need blue food coloring, and we need yellow food coloring, and we need red food coloring. And I'm going to put them aside. And the next thing we need to do is we need to have our dough. We need to have six, one, two, three, four, five, six, little pieces, little things of dough, little balls of dough, all right? Now, the next thing we need to do is take our paper bags and we are going to put the dough inside the paper bag like this. And we're gonna just shake it up like this with the flour. Now, we're going to take some red because the first color of the rainbow is red and we're going to put it inside the bag and we're going to put it down because we don't need it anymore we're going to shake it up like this and maybe squish it a little bit and you see it's red you see how it's red yes we're going to just squish it squish it squish it with the dough in there like that sort of mix it up might take a little while to do that and now we're going to take the next plastic bag and we're going to put in and shake it around put in the cookie dough shake it around and now we're going to put in yellow like this okay and now we're going to have yellow and we squish it around and we have yellow see that we'll have yellow can you see the yellow yes just squish it around a little bit so sort of like play-doh sort of like play-doh except that we have flour in it <laughs> and we're going to lay that aside now the next color we're going to use is blue we're going to put the ball in here shake it around shake it shake it shake it and put some blue inside the bag like this okay and we're going to squish it around so it's going to be blue 
squish it, squish it, squish it. It takes a little while to mix it all up, but you might have to put a little bit more glue in it. But just keep squishing it around. Don't get discouraged. Just keep squishing it around. Eventually it'll turn to glue. Maybe have to put a little bit more glue in there. All right, so now I have the color of blue. Okay, so I have blue. So I'm going to put that down. So now I have red and I have yellow and I have uh, blue. And now I'm going to be making orange because that's another color that we're going to have for our rainbow. So I'm putting in my cookie dough, squish it around with the flour. Now, do you remember what colors made orange? Yes, yellow. So I'm going to put some drops of yellow in here and red. And I'm going to put some drops of red in here like this. And now I'm going to squish it together and let's see if it makes orange or not. Oh, it does make orange. Just keep squishing it around. Yeah, keep squishing it, squishing it like this. Oh, it does make orange, doesn't it? Yes. Yes, there it is. All right, so now we have orange. Now the next color of the rainbow is green. So we're going to put the cookie dough in here, take the flour, squish it around. Now we're going to put yellow in here. And you remember what colors made green? Right. Yellow and blue make green. So we're going to put it in there like that. And we're going to squish it together. Oh, look at that! It made green, didn't it? So now we have green. Yes. And that didn't take as long as the others. Now, the next color we're going to do is purple. What color is made purple? Right, blue. So I'm going to put some drops of blue in there. And red. You're right. Blue and red made purple. All right, and we're going to squish it around and see if it makes purple. Oh, it does make purple. Now we have all our ingredients for our rainbow cookies. Now we need our cookie tin. So we're going to bring our cookie tin out here. And we're going to spray it with baking spray so that it doesn't like that. And we're going to take a little paper towel and sort of wipe it in like this, like this. And now we're going to take and make our rainbow cookie. So the first color, of course, we're going to have is red. So we take our red. And remember I said it's a little messy, so you might have to use rubber gloves or plastic gloves. So I'm going to take mine out of here. And take the dough out of here. And it's, it's the red dough. And that's gonna be my first color. And I'm going, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some flour on my cookie, on this cookie thing here. And I'm going to roll it up and I will have red. That's my first color of my rainbow. So I'm going to take my plastic bag, throw it away because I don't need it anymore unless I have more cookie dough. If I have more cookie dough in here, then I'll have enough for my next rainbow cookie. All right. So I have my red. 
Now, the next color I need is orange, so I'm gonna look for my orange bag that I made. All right, and I'm going to take this out, my orange bag. this out and it's a little messy yes it is I think if you had plastic gloves it's better because my hands are getting all messed up with this and you're just going to put it underneath like this you see underneath so you have this one on top you have an orange now you're going to put that aside and the next color you're going to use is yellow so we're going to find our yellow, and we're going to take that, and we are going to make another strip. Of yellow. Okay, and we're going to put that underneath. So we have our yellows. So now we have our red and our orange and our yellow. And now the next colors we're going to put in is green. So we're going to look for our green one. Here's our green bag. Take our green bag. And we're going to put in our green. Roll it. We might need a little flower on these too because sometimes it's hard to manipulate here. So I'm going to make my little strip, roll it like this, put the strip underneath like this, okay. And the next color that I'm going to need is what color? Blue, right, blue. So I'm going to get my blue, and blue is over here, so I'm going to take my blue out here. And I'm going to roll it like this. And again, I'm going to put it underneath. Now I'm squishing all these together. So it's a rainbow. All right. And the last color is purple. Ooh, that's my favorite color. I love purple. So I'm going to take purple. And again, I'm going to squish that dough. Squish it, squish it, and I'm going to roll it like this, and I'm going to put it underneath. All right. Now I have, I'm going to squish it all together. Now I have my cookie, and of course you can make a whole lot of those if you have six people in your family, you probably need six cookies, right? So. <clears throat> Make the cookies. I'm going to wash my hands a little bit because I have lots of color on my hand, lots of dough. Good thing to get it off right away and not leave it on there. It'll come off if you quickly take it off. So, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to make our sprinkles. So, I'm going to take another plastic bag and let's say I want to make Oh, let's say, hmm, take another plastic bag, take this one. I want to make um, green sprinkles. All right, so now I'm gonna take this bag, I'm gonna put sugar in it. Some sugar in it like this. Whoop, my sugar in it. Just a little bit, not much, you don't need much. And I'm gonna take my Remember what color is made green? Yes, yellow. So I'm gonna put a little yellow in here. And blue. See, I had three colors that I was using to make the other colors. Those are called primary colors. Now I'm making secondary colors because green is a secondary color. So I'm just squishing it up like this. And now I have green sprinkles, 
and I can take my green sprinkles and I can just sprinkle them all over my cookie like this. Not too many, just enough. Just enough, yes. Mm -hmm. A little bit more, maybe just a little bit more sprinkles on here. And so now you have your rainbow cookie and then you can bake it and it'll be ready for your party. Yes. Well, I know that Miss Eddie, before we go, Miss Eddie wants to tell you the Leprechaun Manners song. And remember, the leprechaun, leprechauns are tricky and they also don't have very good manners. Well, Miss Eddie made up a little poem and it goes like this. I will read it, right, Miss Eddie? Can I read it? Okay, all right. A leprechaun licks his fingers and his toes. He licks his knife and then picks his nose. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh me, oh my, is that any way that a leprechaun with manners should be? <gasps> no. A leprechaun does not put his napkin on his lap. And then he talks while eating and he takes a nap. Oh my goodness, Miss Eddie, that is funny. Oh me, oh my, is that any way that a leprechaun with manners should be? And furthermore, he is loud and rude. I'm so happy. I'm not a leprechaun. Are you? Yes, I'm so happy I'm not a leprechaun. Well, boys and girls, next week, we are going to be setting our table and getting ready for our party. And remember, you'll need your centerpiece. You'll need your clover napkin that we made. You'll need your placemats that we made. And you'll need your leprechaun crown. Remember your shamrock crown. If you don't have those things, it's okay. But we are going to have our little party. And you can invite your parents to come to our party. All right, we'll see you next week. Bye, boys and girls. Say bye. Bye. We love you. Bye.